Hi guys, welcome to Tech Tricks Tutorial. Today we're going to talk about how to build a clothing website on Wix. It's a step-by-step -step guide to follow easily. And don't forget to hit the like and subscribe button. Let's dive right in. So the first thing that we are going to do is we are going to log in into our Wix website. And once you're there, we're going to click on my sites here at the left portion of our interface. So just click go to my sites. And in the my sites page, these are the websites that we've created previously. So we're going to go ahead and create a new site for our clothing website. So just go to the upper right and click create new site. So which platform do you want to use? We are going to click on Wix. And you have here a question, what kind of website are you creating? So since we are going to create a clothing website, so we're going to type clothing. And you have your clothing shop, clothing manufacturer, boutique, blogger, photographer, rental store, repair service, photography studio, exchange shop, and a lot more. We're just going to go ahead and click on clothing shop. So it depends on you what website are you creating and then click next. So we're going to write the name of our store. So let's say this one and then just click next. So here are the things that we want to add to our website. So we have here a few options. So we can have a blog, bookings, events, portfolio, online programs, music, video, present plans, forum groups, files, sh file sharing, table reservations. There's a lot. So our online store is already built in. It's already there. So we have here different things that we can add. So just choose from here. And after that, we're just going to click next. So here are different templates that you can choose from. So we'll just look for a template that best suits your website. So we're just going to click edit once you've chosen a template. Alright, so now this is our website and at the left portion, we can add a lot of things here and we can add um, the elements, the text, image, buttons, strip, decorative, box, gallery, and so on and so forth. So you can just explore these ones and then we're going to click on add section. So we can add different sections here like welcome, about, team, contact, promotion, services, subscribe, testimonials, and clients. And then for the pages and menu, we can customize our website, our home, our shop, um, different things here. And we can also add a page. And then here is the site design. So it's where we can start customizing the color and text theme of our app website, the page background, page transitions. And also in our Wix app market, we can choose different apps that we want to add in our site. So you can just explore this one later on as to what app do you want to add in your site. And then here in the media part, you can also upload your own media and you can use your different social media platforms like Facebook, Instagram, and you can also use your Google Drive and your Google Photos. So you can scroll this one later. If you don't have any images or videos, you can choose from the week free Wix images and the free Wix videos available here. And then if you have your own, then just click upload media. So here is our clothing website. So for you to be able to edit your website, you're just going to click on the section that you want to edit and just click on edit text if you want to change this one. So we're going to change this one to our store name. There we go. So this part here, you can change the text, the size, the width, and also the colors and so on and so forth, the background. Then you can choose what you're going to add here. Okay, so now we're going to start adding images or products in our site. So we're going to click on Add Apps at the left portion. We're going to go to our Wix App Market. And then we are going to go to the search box and type store then click on wix stores 
it's already pre-installed so we're going to add it again all right so here is our Wix stores and we are going to add a product so this is our dashboard and at the right side you can see this tab more actions so you can export your physical products to a csv file or you can import multiple products to your store or rearrange the order of your products from the category page so you can choose from these actions here and you can also add a new product your own product now if we are going to look at the items here so we're just going to click on that certain product and then if we are going to delete that we're just going to click the three dots icon here and we are just going to click delete or we can edit we can duplicate and we're going to delete this one so click delete now since this is a clothing website we're going to look for clothes here that we can add in our website Now we'll stop from there and we're going to try to edit this certain product. We can change the name of this product and we can also add or indicate if it's a new arrival and then description. We can um, change the description here and then the product info, the return and refund policies and then the pricing. You can also change this one. Uh, and you can also change the price and then indicate if it's on sale or we can show the price per unit and then the cost of goods profit margin so in the custom text part you allow your customers to personalize this product using the custom text field and then the product options there color you can also indicate another color if you want say black and then we're going to add purple and then click apply then you're going to click on this button here if it's pre-order and you're just going you can also create a subscription to easily offer your products on a recurring basis with subscriptions once you're done with that we're just going to click on save and here we're going to set up payments so this one it it differs on which country you're from we're just going to uh, confirm this one since we're in the philippines so you have here different payment options you have here paypal manual payments or you can click on see more options so you have there hit pay dragon pay faster pay online payments and send it it went well at home we're going to use at home since this is a bit popular in the philippines so we're going to click at home so you're going to enter our at home credentials in the form below and then click connect then your at home account will be connected to your Wix account so after that just click connect so we're going to set up our shipping methods so we're just going to go to settings and then click shipping and fulfillment if you're done just click save all right so now we're back in our website and we are going to just change this image so we're going to click on change image and we are going to upload our own media. This one can um, edit, crop, adjust, create a video or cut off background. And then you can add text, the file info, and then just click on choose image. And we're going to change this one also. So we have here two options. What are we going to add? Is it a physical product or a digital file? So we're going to click physical product. And then we're going to add images or we're going to add videos. We're just going to add images. And then click on the product that you want to add to your website then click add to page so we're going to add the name of the product and we're going to add the price on sale 
the discount is 5%. Then just click save. This is what your clothing website looks like once you're done. So we're just going to click on the different devices mode. So this is what our website looks like on a mobile phone. And that's it. That's how easy you can build a clothing website on Wix. If you have questions, please don't hesitate to write them below and I will see you guys next time. Bye!